I'm going to be sharing with you how I helped this busy mom of three lose 18 pounds in 12 weeks, eating more food, not focusing on fat loss, but actually by healing her gut. If you tried every diet out there, you're on low calories, you have thyroid issues going on, you're training so hard, yet you don't see the results. And this is especially for my woman as we are getting older, 30 plus. What used to work no longer works. Before I dive into exactly what I did with her diet, training, and nutrition, all focused on the gut specifically, I want to share a little bit about how our gut affects our metabolism. When we have an imbalance of good and bad bacteria in the gut, also known as gut dysbiosis, this can lead to inflammation, insulin resistance, and even impact our energy metabolism and fat storage. Some things that can lead to gut dysbiosis are a diet, high in refined carbohydrates, very low of our fiber, chronic stress, medications, or even other environmental factors. But if you wanna know more about leaky gut and how this imbalance happens, I want you to check out a video that I did above all on leaky gut, what it is, and I have a full three-part series. Let's go into exactly what I did step by step to help her lose the weight focusing on her gut. The first thing, when I hop on with all my clients, I have a questionnaire that I go through. I ask us, were we a C-section? Were we bottle fed? Were we on a lot of antibiotics? Do we have thyroid issues going on? Did the doctors actually run the correct tests to see if we have thyroid issues going on? Because 90% of them do not. What was our past diet history? How's our stress? How's our sleep? How's our hormones? Are we perimenopause? Did we have hysterectomy? Do we have our gallbladder? Because we aren't what we eat, we are what we absorb. And as we get older, when we have you know chronic inflammation going on, we have digestive issues, we have thyroid issues going on, when we push our body on these low carb, low calorie diets, doing tons of cardio, all they do is run our hormones into the floor. And that is not what we want. That's not gonna give you the results that you want. That's gonna leave you with chronic cravings, low energy, and non-sustainable results. It's gonna be a yo-yo out of it. Let's talk about her diet and her nutrition. So it's one thing just to cut our calories low. I started off by getting a baseline at where she was at. She was under 1200 calories a day, low energy, chronic cravings. So what I did was I focused more on a body composition. So as we were on this journey together, I was actually increasing her calories specific through specific macronutrients with her to support her metabolism, support her insulin response so that she's actually able to be eating more food now, building muscle, supporting her recovery supporting her hormones and getting results. This is the key. Let's talk about the gut. So when she came to me, she had a lot of digestive issues going on. She was in a place where she had chronic bloating, digestive issues, food sensitivities, and even constipation. When we're not moving our bowels, that is the number one thing. I have something called a 4R protocol that I do with my clients. Number one is we're hopping on a call every single week, a Zoom call. And on these calls, I'm taking through my clients, teaching them what to eat, when to eat, the foods to eat. But I also implemented a complete protocol because she had underlying issues going on like parasites, the gut dysbiosis, leaky gut, food sensitivities, and we needed to get those bowels starting to move so we don't have that fermentation in the gut to where the bad bacteria goes over. Remember, our gut is where we're absorbing and assimilating our nutrients. So if she is in a place of leaky gut with chronic cravings and we got dysbiosis going on, we want to heal and seal that lining of the gut so she's able to absorb, assimilate her nutrients. She's able to have more energy, see more results, have less cravings, less bloating, and we're able to add in more food without having those reactions down the line. So over the 12 weeks, what I did was I started her off on a anti-inflammatory kind of diet specific to her body, what her food allergies and sensitivities were. Then as we were moved in the beginning, that first week, I started correcting the insufficiencies. We had a little bit of low stomach acid, pancreatic enzymes. We had the leaky gut, so I added in specific probiotics to actually clinically proven to heal the inner lining of the gut 60% in 30 days. 
I also added in specific herbs to get rid of the gut dysbiosis while we were healing that inner lining of the gut and correcting the insufficiencies. Short and simple, over the four weeks, I was able to increase her food, heal the inner lining of her gut, get her to where she's having two daily bowel movements. She no longer has any indigested food in her stool. She has energy freaking through the roof and anxiety, all of that is gone. So we're in a place now where she is in a sustainable way able to continue on her fat loss journey, losing the weight to reach her goals. She's able, we corrected her stress by the way, cause stress and the time were a huge one. So I talked to her about time blocking, stress management. So now she's sleeping better, recovering better, energy's better, guts better, you know, hormones are balancing out. And this is the key guys. This is what I'm trying to show you. It's not about the calories in versus the calories out. Look at what's happening with her body. And it's all through healing the gut. If you need help, I want you to head to the description below, fill out my questionnaire. I will be in touch with you in the next 24 hours to set up the call to see if we're that perfect fit. Stop cutting everything low. If we are not absorbing and assimilating our nutrients, we're run down. That's not the right approach. We have to start working smarter versus harder, focusing on our gut. And to me, the education aspect is huge. So when I'm on my calls with my clients every week, I am teaching them what to eat, why we're making these changes. We're adding in specific foods and nutrients for their thyroid. I have clients with anemia. You know, do we have absorption issues with certain key nutrients? Where are those insufficiencies? So that your body is able to feel its best self and get sustainable results. We got to stop focusing on fat loss and start chasing our health. That was me too. When I stopped focusing on how can I lose the weight? How low can my weight get? How hard can I push myself? Cause I was over 180 pounds. I got down to 90 and then I had all my health issues with my gut, my thyroid, my hormones. When I focused on healing my body and starting from my gut, it was almost like when I healed my gut, the weight came off. I didn't have to train so hard. I was training so hard and felt so inflamed. Train smarter versus harder, focus on our gut. And if this story inspires you, you've been to everyone and you need help, fill out that questionnaire and I will be right in touch with you. I love you guys. Make sure to subscribe, share this video with a friend and I will see you tomorrow. And listen to this video. If you haven't checked it out, I'm gonna put a video right here for you all on gut, leaky gut, and it is going to be game changer for you if you're looking to lose weight and transform your body and get to the root cause. Mwah! Love you.